This is Mrs. York. Mrs. York suffers from hip pain. Uh, she had a, a CAT scan with mild hip arthritis. She responded in the past to hip injections um, dramatically quite. Uh, she walked into the office almost crippled and she left feeling much better. I'm hoping we can reproduce that today. This is her second hip shot. She saw a surgeon. I don't think he wanted to operate yet, nor does she probably want surgery yet, correct? And um, the plan is to give her a hip injection and then possibly in the future if she needs further treatments within the year to repeat with a visco supplement or PRP. If not, maybe to um, do either nerve blocks of the hip or more likely just wait a little bit with some physical therapy, weight loss, and hopefully uh, if she needs a repeat steroid injection next year, we'll do it. So I'm going to look for her hip joint. Increased depth. Okay, here we found the head of her femur and the labrum is medial to that right over here. And I'm going to find the neck of the femur, increased depth. And we see the neck of the femur, which is like a valley and the head of the femur, which is like a hill, trying to get them both aligned in the same view, in the same plane, and I found it. And now we're already prepped with chlorhexidine. I'm going to target the head of the femur underneath the capsule, a little 25 gauge, three and a half inch spinal needle. Okay, a little pinch, my dear, all right? And pinch. You okay? Mm -hmm. It's working my way. And right here, I landed on the bone, and I'm going to aspirate and inject. Okay. My needle's on the bone, under the capsule. Okay, and I'm injecting. And you saw a little air going under the capsule of the knee above the periosteum. And we're done.